Okay, a lot of people are always interested in how to take out the airbag, if they're gonna change out the steering wheel, or maybe swap out buttons or something. So this is just on how to remove the airbag. So the airbag sits right here. And these two little clips hold two pins. So the airbag itself just has two pins on it, locks into place. So in order to get the airbag out, you have to take these and they have to be pulled back to release them. So if this is in the car, what you wanna do is you need to get to these little holes right here. And these holes are at different angles. So this one, as I just drop this in here, is kind of at this angle. This one is at the other angle. So to get to these, while this is in the car, like this, you wanna take your wheel, turn it 180 degrees, like this. And then you can start working on it. The reason why, because now these are above the area. So let's say the, the steering wheel is in the car, it's like this, you're gonna reach around to the back of the steering wheel, you're gonna kind of slide this in at an angle until it kind of stops. You're gonna kind of feel it and then pull. So what you're doing on this side, flip this around, is as, as this comes in, it's gonna stop right behind here. So as you can see, as I pull back on this, watch this, it moves out of the way. When it does, it undoes a clip. Same thing for the other side, except this will go in at a different angle, like this. This will come in and watch this. So you just kind of pull that back, the, it'll pop right out. And to put it back in, I do the same thing. Just kind of push it in and then let it go. It locks into place. Same thing on the other side. And then when you're done, you just spin it back around. So before we take out the, the airbag, you're gonna wanna disconnect the horn real quick. So what we're gonna do is undo the horn. You pull a little tiny fuse. You're like, well, I don't have a fuse puller. Yes, you do. So back here in the boot, the trunk, whatever you wanna call it, you pop this little door open. And down here in the corner, little white thing. You just pull it out. Squeeze it, pull it out. It's a fuse puller. Small ones, big ones. So, go over here. Open the door. And you can see this little door here. Just kind of push it forward. It pops open. You'll see here, the one in the middle, the horn. Over here, it's this blue one right here so you just take this small end kind of just push it over you just kind of pull it out that's it okay so here's the tool um, that we're using inside or outside now with the steering wheel so I'm gonna just show you what happens when you pop up the steering you know the airbag and we reach behind the back here there's two little holes this first one they're opposite and forward kind of pull it that pops off all right went the wrong way and there boom it pops right off so you put it back on there's the springs you'll see i'll stick this in here and then just kind of that's the way it works so that's it put it back on you do the things first kind of line it up stick this in here and push it in this one over here, go back, lock it in place, and that's it. It's back in place. And when you're done, you just reverse that by, you know, take the airbag out, replace it, whatever you need to do so it doesn't, you know, keep, make the horn keep beeping. And when you're done, just kind of line it up, center, center, back in place, easy peasy. Put the door back on. And don't forget to put our, our little tool back here that just goes in there slides in place make the door two little tabs goes in here one little tab right there all done so that's how you get the the airbag out uh, that's all this video is about i do have one on, on replacing the buttons replacing the steering wheel but that seems to be a, a something people really want to know about so hope you enjoyed how to uh, pop off your airbag if you want to you know, do your steering wheel, replace buttons, or do other things. Thanks for watching.